Uh, welcome back. In this segment, we're going to create the MIG object. So let's come up to the blue ball, create objects. Our object property opens up. I'm going to click on this little icon to be able to select the MIG. Okay, the MIG is there. I'm going to change the object up here to underscore MIG. So we have a name now, object MIG. And it's visible. And we're going to create... Uh, Let's just go ahead and leave this as it is. Check OK. Uh, next, we're going to go back to our object uh, F117. Open that up. Here, we want to uh, add an event. Let me go ahead and delete this first. We're going to create a new event. We're going to call it Create. This little looks a little like a light bulb. Add this up here. We're going to add a piece of code with that under here for control. Add some code. New code that we're going to introduce, to, introduce you to is instance create. So we can create that instance of that MIG in the room. So instance, got to spell it right, I-N-S-T-A-N-C-E underscore create, C-R-E-A-T-E. And we're going to set up a set of... Uh, uh, parentheses. The first is going to be, it's going to be an X, Y, and then the object that we create. So the first is going to be object, and the, ob the room is 640 across by 480 deep. So halfway across is about 320. And we're going to leave it at zero at the top of the screen. And next we're going to put in OBJ for object underscore MIG. This will create the MIG in about the middle of the room at the top of the screen. So click OK. And we'll click OK. Now let's go ahead and run this and see if we get this MIG created at the top of the screen. It's loading. And you can see here's our little plane. And at the top of the screen we got the MIG. So we got the MIG. It's just sitting up there. Next we need to go ahead and close this out. we got to give that MIG some speed. Now what we want to do is select the object MIG. And down here for events, use this little yellow light bulb again, create, and over here a piece of code. We're going to give him some speed, so drag the code over. This time it's going to be vertical speed, so V, S, P, E, E, D for vertical speed equals, and it's going to be a plus 5 because we want him to move down. Go ahead and click the green arrow, or the green check mark, and then OK, and then let's try to run this one more time and see if we get the MIG to come down. It's loading. And here he comes, coming down through the, comes across the plane, no problem. Okay, that looked good. Go ahead and close this out. Okay, we've just created the MIG object, and he has a vertical speed of 5, and he is coming down from the top of the room. That's it for this segment. Thanks.